I think this is a very, very well balanced Australian side. So now I think, I think I'd be happy with the eleven that started the tournament against South Africa. I don't think so. Uh, the, looking at the squad that played West Indies, it looks a very balanced side. They've got fast bowlers, they've got spinners, they've, the batting is there. So I think they played the best uh, side in the first game and they, need, they should continue with that at least for a couple of matches. Australia don't play spin as much as what you know, the likes of India, Pakistan, Bangladesh do play against. Is their footwork going to be tip top right from the, the word go? I'd argue there wouldn't be. So I think another spin bowler on these surfaces would probably be a better tool against Australia. You are going to attack uh, Australian batsmen, it has to be spin. And the wickets are a bit slower, the grounds are, yeah, apart from Sharjah, the ground is quite big. So th you can bring an extra spinner and uh, make a bit uh, difficult for the Aussies. I think Stoinis' batting is too, is too important to Australia at that number six. If he's up to it, he bowls. If he's not, I wouldn't jeopardise that because I, would, I think his batting is too important. Uh, you don't need to uh, you don't need to push any player if he's uh, vulnerable to injury so he can bat as a play as a batsman and he's a good enough batsman to bat as a batsman in an australian batting lineup i think the nature of this opposition which is warner finch marsh not so much smith but i think there will be you i would imagine you'd see a lot more overs in the, the power play than in spin department than you will do in seam against australia against bangladeshis if you look at the batting lineup, yes, they use their fast bowlers, but against Australia, I uh, truly believe that they're going to they're going to bowl at least two to three overs of spin. The one thing I will say is that I think you have to cash in early on the surfaces. You've got to get runs in the power play, and I think sometimes taking a risk, losing a wicket, isn't normally a bad thing if you can maybe get an extra five, ten runs because I think that will go a long way to you know, setting a good total or, or chasing a good total at the end of the game. These uh, pitches are giving uh, fair chances to batsmen and bowlers. It's not only batsmen's tournament. I truly believe that these pitches uh, will make the, all the matches more exciting and these pitches will give a lot of chances to the bowlers as well.